Hello and welcome to Ban in a Box 2025 for Windows. This video is part of our bootcamp series of videos where we take a particular task in Ban in a Box and show you how it's done, and also show off new features in the program along the way. So in this video, I'm going to show off the new AI Lyrics Generator feature. This feature can be accessed in the Multipicker Library window, and it features creative songwriting functions that suggest or generate themes, styles, titles, and even entire song ideas. It also offers customized AI lyrics generation, allowing you to create lyrics from scratch, generate the next line, or experiment with rhymes, synonyms, antonyms, related words, or alliterations. You can enhance your existing lyrics by adding vivid imagery, emotion, richer vocabulary, or more natural phrasing. So I have a slow Americana song that I just entered the chords for, and I'm now going to use the AI Lyrics Generator feature to add lyrics to this song. So first of all, the AI Lyrics feature can be accessed from a new tab in the multi-picker, but you can also access it by just typing, as if you were typing a chord, A-I-L. Enter. First, I'll explore this window a bit. There are six AI Lyric modes that you can use here, which you select from this menu. And I'll go through all of these in a little bit, but first I'll show you all of the main elements of the entire dialogue. This area here displays the function of whichever of those six modes you're in. Every one of those modes has a generate button like this. So this middle area gives you the AI response when you press generate. And then here is the user scratch pad. This is basically just a big text field that you can enter text in. So the Americana style and song that I just put together here has kind of a plaintive sound. So I think maybe I'm gonna try and write some lyrics about missing an old friend. So maybe I'll start with, I miss you, my old friend. And I'll go from there. And then when I start using the AI features, if there are certain parts of the AI response that I want to keep, I can copy it from there to this scratch pad. And the text here gets saved with your song. So you can use this area to work on your song, and then when you close Band in a Box, if you open the same file again, everything is still waiting for you here. And then finally, at the bottom left here, we have the common elements. As I said before, each mode here has a generate button, and so any data you've entered in the common elements area will then be taken into account every time you press generate. So as I mentioned before, this is a song about missing an old friend, so I'll enter that here. The genre is Americana. The default for language is English, so I don't need to enter anything here, but you certainly can write in other languages, and this is where you'd enter that info. And the only lyric fragments I have right now is what I just entered in the scratch pad, so I'll put that here, so that now every time I press generate, it will take all of these things into consideration. So now I'll go through the various modes. So first of all, if you've already got some lyrics in mind, you might just want to use this as a rhyming dictionary. And you can type text here, but since this auto input field is selected, when I highlighted the text in the scratch pad, it just automatically entered that here. If instead I just highlight my old friend, then that gets entered in. And I'll press generate. I think I like a broken heart to mend. So for now at any rate, I'll put that in the scratch pad. And in this dialog, you can also do synonyms, antonyms, related words, or alliteration. The next mode is the Songwriting Assistant, which is pretty freeform AI. As I mentioned before, the data in common elements gets taken into account every time you press generate. So I could enter additional info here, but I'll just go with the suggested let's get started and see what it gives me. All right, so it gave me a few ideas here. So I like this first part, we shared our dreams on the back porch swing. So I'm going to scrap what I've already got in the scratch pad and just put this there instead. 
Continuing through the modes, custom is even more freeform. You can ask questions here in whatever way you want. A lot of what you can do in the other windows can also be done here, but with a more ad lib approach. With the inspiration mode, you can generate song themes, titles, or even entire song ideas. With lyric improvements, you can refine, rewrite, extend, or add to your lyrics. And then finally, full song lyrics is exactly what it sounds like. This mode can generate complete song lyrics, matching a specific form, the number of lines per section, and other details. And I think I'm going to use this mode right now. I did like this little group of lyrics, so I'll put that in the common area under Lyric Fragments. The song that I have here has an A, A, B, A form, so that's what I'm going to enter here. As far as lines per section, particularly for a slower song like this, I'm kind of thinking of a line covering a single bar of the song. So it would kind of be like da 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 etc. So if there's one line per bar, I have eight bars per section. So eight lines per section. And if I was thinking about the number of syllables in each of those bars, da 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 if it was a melodic rhythm, something like that, five to eight syllables would probably fit perfectly. I still, of course, have all of the data saved in common elements, so I'm going to just go ahead and generate a whole song. And now I have an entire song, Back Porch Memories. Now, I don't have a specific melody in mind, but I can kind of get the rhythm of this in my head. I'll start the song playing again, and then I'll just start reading these lyrics rhythmically in time with the music to see how it fits. We shared our dreams on the back porch swing, counting stars, not worrying about a thing. The fireflies danced in the gentle breeze. Okay, so I'm going to stop it right there. So that actually felt really good rhythmically, right up to bar three. But then at bar four, it didn't feel right to just continue on. It felt like bar four should mostly be a rest. So I'm now starting to realize that what I actually wanted was six lines per section rather than eight, and done in groups of three. But I don't want to just scrap this and start over. I really like what it's given me so far. So I'm going to use the custom area and just enter in some very specific requests. I'll copy all of this to the clipboard. And then I'm going to type in here, for these lyrics below, I'd like every fourth line and every eighth line in each section to be removed. Then if the lyrics don't make sense, they can be rewritten a little bit to make sense. So now I'm going to clear this again and I'll press generate and see what it comes up with. So it's basically done exactly what I asked it to do. There are now six lines in each section. The ends of lines one and two rhyme, swing, thing. And the ends of lines four and five rhyme, glow, grow. So I'm going to start playback in Bannon Box again, and I'm going to do the same thing, just read these lyrics rhythmically and see how it fits. We shared our dreams on the back porch swing, counting stars, not worrying about a thing. The fireflies danced in the gentle breeze. 
laughter echoed under the moon's soft glow, where time stood still, letting our hearts grow. I miss you, my friend, those nights with you. So yeah, that now matches perfectly with this song. So I'm going to now take all of this and paste it into the user scratch pad, which, as I mentioned before, will now be saved with this song. So now the last thing I want to do is actually have all of these lyrics in the lyric layer in the bars right above the chords in the chord chart. And this is actually really easy to do. So first of all, I'm going to go and turn on that layer. So that's under views, chord display, layers, bar lyrics. Now, lyrics can be copied and pasted quite easily into the lyric layer, as long as each line in the text you're copying corresponds with each bar, with empty lines meaning there will be no lyrics in that bar. So I already pointed out that each line here corresponds to one bar, so this is almost done for us right here. All I have to do is just delete the empty lines in between the various verses, and also add a return if there are any places where I want it to be in the next bar. So this line here is the first bar, so it's all good. This line here is the second bar, so that's all good. Most of this is the third line, so that's good. Except the very last word I'll just put at the beginning of bar four, and so that needs to be on its own line. And then I'm going to follow that same general pattern with this. I'll put U on a new line, so that will end up in bar 8. So now I'm just going to do the same general thing with the rest of these. This line, grass, will be on its own line, and friend will be on its own line. Now we're at the chorus, and I'll put lend on its own line, and friend on its own line. And then I'll do the same thing here, apart on its own line, and goodbye on its own line. And that is the entire song, so I will now just copy all of this text, and I'll paste it in the lyrics layer right at the first bar. And that has now entered all of those lyrics into our song. And now, of course, we could use some of the other tools in the AI Lyrics dialog to further refine the song. We hope you enjoyed this video on the new AI Lyrics Generator feature in Box 2025. Thanks for watching and have fun.